one it is alexis and lillian the year is coming to an end so this is probably going to be our last video or one of our last videos that we're going to be doing this year mm -hmm. and we're going to be talking about some of our sweetest moments together Aww. because we love talking about that kind of stuff <laughs> and you guys like hearing it so but yeah we thought why not wrap up this year with reminiscing about some of our memories and there's so many yeah there really is a lot which and is so good but yeah. then i feel like when there's so many then it's hard to like think of particular moments yeah because i'm like hold on the thing, overdrive overdrive i know alexis hates when i say something about my hair but i just want to say that i'm growing out my hair for the like fifth time and it was my plan to do it during the winter so i can just always wear a hat when i'm in these awkward stages but then i'm like but i'm always on video when i do this so i feel like i have ellen's haircut right now and that's not what i want but it's just a stage i gotta get through <laughs> shut up so let's jump into it our favorite memories but if you're watching this video i assume that you enjoy watching lesbian love stories and we have a way for you to enjoy this holiday season by watching even more of them Ooh, thank you surfshark vpn for sponsoring this video so it's basically a virtual private network to keep your online exploring private and secure and it also lets you enable content that isn't accessible from your current location like different netflixes mm -hmm. which opens up so many doors for example one of the movies is carol which lillian thinks isn't a christmas movie but i think it is it's one of my favorites you can just go to the u.s and watch it another one is disobedience you can watch that in netflix canada orphan black amazing canadian sci-fi queer show you can watch that in netflix uk there's also my days of mercy it's with elliot page that's also on netflix uk and of course if you want to see our personal favorite blue is the warmest color you can watch that in netflix france check it out so click the link below to get 84 percent off and four extra free months and a 30-day money-back guarantee so oh. if it's not for you no harm in trying so back to our love story oh you can't download that with surfshark <laughs> only here on youtube you go first one of my favorite moments was how we first said i love you to each other Aww. and it was so crazy and it's like it happened pretty fast it did we were in montreal we had known each other for i think like two months <laughs> but we hung out every single every day, day. And we came back after like a long night out with friends. I was confused about what was going on between us. And I could tell she was really nervous and was like stumbling over her words. And I was like, what is it? What is it? Just tell me. And then she said, I think I'm starting to more than just like you. And I felt like all this adrenaline rushed through my body. And I was like, oh my God, oh my God, she's going to say it. And like, I feel that way too. I was right? like, ugh. Because I was so afraid that you were going to be like, whoa, this chick's like going way too fast for me. <laughs> so I was like, I don't want to like actually say the L word. And then I was like, say it, say it. What do you mean? I was so afraid. And then she said, well, what comes after like Lillian? And that was just like dead like you know when you just get like these rushes and i was like oh my god and then she said i think i'm starting to fall for you mm -hmm. and then i said i'm falling in love with you too alexa Aww. so cute i bet you can see your little hair see oh no turn your head turn your head it's when you're fully on the side then you have a little little bird feather hair um okay next moment how we officially became a couple because after all of this we still weren't officially a couple because i don't know she had some weird ideas of relationships hey we were in copenhagen when she was first visiting me and i was like okay i'm gonna in this time make her my official girlfriend so i figured out that she is a romantic and she probably wanted me to ask her officially mm -hmm. will you be my girlfriend so i was like okay i'll give her the romantic moment and I was imagining maybe like on a bridge somewhere in Copenhagen Aww. around like the kind of in the question but then it didn't really go as planned no. what actually happened was first night together we pretty much didn't get any sleep it was like 6 a.m. we were in bed talking in a hotel in Sweden 
I was like so happy to finally have her there but I was also so tired so I was like drifting in and out of sleep while Alexis was talking ah! and you know when you get to the point where you don't really know what you're saying anymore sometimes and then I was just like saying all these things and I was like and I think you're also a really good girlfriend oh my God. and then as I said girlfriend I was like awake and I was like what did I just say no, I was like it was just like silence and then she's like am I a girlfriend because you haven't even asked me yet and, and I, I haven't like, been telling people that you're my girlfriend and I was just like well, like, are you my girlfriend or not? Because, like, I want you to be. <laughs> and then she said yes. And it wasn't really the, like, romantic European moment <laughs> that I was planning. Instead, it was me half asleep in bed. But oh, it's I wouldn't have it any and other way. It's a sweet moment. Yeah. Right? Like, look, we're telling it now. It's one of our <clears throat> sweetest moments. That's right? true. Mm -hmm. We stayed up another two hours and then we enjoyed our first hotel breakfast at 8 a.m. officially as a couple. Aww. And we had a pink journal that we always wrote into. Oh, we haven't wrote in that for so long. We still have it. It's purple actually. Because I, I got know. it for us. Our color is purple. Oh, did you think it was cute when I sent that to you in the mail? Yeah, of course. And I wrote in it and I was like, this should be our journal. Yeah, we had like a journal when we were long distance that we sent back and forth and then we could like read all that the other person wrote. See, being in a long distance relationship is like so romantic. Oh. I recommend it to everyone out there. Lillian, yes, I'm so in love with you so much. Seriously though? Mm -hmm. I need to love you. No, you need to take a picture. Oh, no, I don't need to love you. Mm -hmm. This is round three with ice cream in bed. Oh. Baby. Another moment was our first anniversary then, a, mm. a year later. So today we are celebrating our one year of knowing each other. Mm. Not one year of being together, but just knowing, <laughs> knowing each, each other. Because <laughs> that's exciting. And Alexis gave me the best gift ever. Aww, was it the best gift ever? So she gave me this ring that <clears throat> I'm sure you've seen me wear before, but I don't think we've ever talked about it. It's a very simple ring, just silver, because I'm a simple gal. <laughs> it has the coordinates of where we met engraved into it. And inside it says, host, which is an insider between us, which we always say when we cheers. Yes. Because I always thought that Lillian was saying, host, instead of host. And I was always like, host. So now it's like how we always say it. Yes. But yes, the coordinates of the Hearn generating station in Toronto where we met. I'm sure a lot of you have heard the story before. If not, we have another video about that. So go check that out, how we actually met. But yeah, I, I really love it so much. And it's so like cute and creative and sweet. Aww. So Lillian is also very creative people. I got a letter in the mail. This was, I was still in Canada. This is in February. This was for my birthday. So one of the pages was a crossword that she handmade herself. So I was like, oh my God, this is so cute. So I'm going through, filling out all the words. It was like cute little memory words that like only we would know. Like, what is my nickname? <laughs> and then one of the words is Berlin. And I was like, okay. So then there was also coordinates so to like for me to look up on the map like this other clue and I was like what's going on? Didn't I also have like old flight tickets in there or something? Oh yes 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 hold on but I'm so confused how did I not guess that? I don't know she ain't that smart guys. Hey! Berlin? That could be a word. So you still don't know it? Of course you're not. Now look in your envelope. Hey! It's a flight! It's in next week. Are you fucking kidding me? So that we can celebrate your birthday in Berlin. Are you freaking kidding me, Lily? And then we have like four days in Berlin and then we have one week in Copenhagen and then you need to go back. But what about my work? I already talked to them. Are you serious, babe? Mm -hmm. I got her a ticket so that we could celebrate her birthday together in Berlin which is where she always wanted to go and we hadn't been together before so that was how we saw each other next we are going to get into Bergheim that's right Aww. And then I had such a nice birthday there that was such a good time that was like a memory I will never forget so all of these moments that we talked about were just from our first year together 
So there's a lot more because we've been together for four years now. It's all been going downhill since then. I th <laughs> there's a lot of other moments, so I might do a sequel to this if you liked it. But one thing we're also gonna do for sure is our funniest memories. Oh, we got a lot of those. <laughs> Just thinking of some right now. Thank you so much Surfshark for sponsoring this video. And if you like this video, please remember to give it a like and to subscribe, it really helps us. And we're excited to see you again in the new year. Cheers! Cheers!